think Jumpy is right. Jumpy? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm talking about him. I just call him Jumpy. His name is Junpei. We're childhood friends. We went to the same elementary school. Wait, stop. Don't tell us stuff we didn't ask you about. Zero's probably watching us right now. What are you gonna do if he's listening in? Oh, would that be bad? Hell yeah, it would! <laughs> Suspicious. We don't know how much that bastard knows about us. Maybe he just picked a bunch of random people to kidnap. If that is the case, then it'd be dangerous for us to let him know too much. If Zero knows who we are, he could go after our families. Maybe he'd tell us he had them to get us to do stuff, you know? But we still need to know what our names are. It's going to be hard to talk to each other if we don't have names. All right, then why don't we have code names? Code names? Yeah, we'll each pick something. Like, I'll be seven. Seven? Why are you seven? Because this bracelet number says seven. Oh, <laughs> I get it. Yeah, that's a good idea. The logic is just... Mwah. All right, I'm going to be Santa. Any of you chumps know Japanese? No. Well, sun means three. So, I'll be Santa. You know, like Santa Claus. Fits, don't you think? My god, I hate this even more voice acted than I did back when this was just what it was. Fucking Santa, or however the heck you put the emphasis on Sam. Then your bracelet number. <laughs> it's so bad. I know Japanese. I'm special. Yeah, it's got a three on it. Good job, Grandpa. Keikaku means plan. Very well then. I'll go next, shall I? My bracelet number is one. Given that, I think Ace seems appropriate. <laughs> this is why you don't let people give themselves their own I'm nicknames. Sure you all know it has eight petals. Which means, of course, that my bracelet number is... Eight. What, you're not gonna make a pun about Hachi? I would appreciate it if you would call me Snick. My bracelet number is two. Since Ace has chosen cards, then I choose dice. Snake eyes, clearly. Snake! Which is particularly relevant given that I am blind. You can't see? I knew it. <laughs> What gave it away? The fact that he hasn't opened his eyes in the last 20 minutes. Me next. <laughs> I forgot how stupid this was. I want to be Clover. You know, like a four-leaf clover. Good luck, right? All right, my number's five. So my code name is going to be... Why you don't get a code name. Point to it now. <laughs> Everyone else gets cool names, but Junpei just gets to be Junpei. I know, I mean, it know really your is. Almost. You're Junpei. Oh. I'm actually kind of mad I didn't grab a beer to have with this right now. <laughs> then you should all call me by my name, too. Because, I mean, it doesn't seem... It doesn't seem fair to Jumpy. You're thinking it's not cool for you to hide your name after you told us his. Uh, What's your bracelet number? It's six. All right, then. Uh, why don't we call you June? June? Yeah, you know, it's the it's the sixth month of the year. So you're June. <laughs> so you're June. I've given you your name. Jumpy. You don't get to pick your own name. Are you good with that? Uh, yeah. Okay, then. So this is how everyone breaks down. One is Ace. Two is Snake. Three is Santa. Four is Clover. Santa, that's what he did. Santa. Five is me. Six is June. Seven is seven. <laughs> and eight is Lotus. That means eight of us have revealed our bracelet numbers. The only one left is... That glasses guy with hair like a bird's nest. <laughs> yeah. Santa is always just so... Like, um, there's this gesture I do when somebody's stuck up where I just stick my pinky in the air and just imagine I'm doing that all the time, Adam. You haven't said a thing so far, have you? My god, he looks even more spazzy in this art style than he did in the original. Uh, he looks like he's been, like, like a deer in headlights. <laughs> what number are you? 
<laughs> what fucking number could he be? Hey, I'm talking to you. Isn't it obvious? There are nine people here. And you know who numbers one through eight are. I'm the only one left. So you're nine? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's your code name? Uh, code name? I don't know who Cam Clark is. What do you want us to call you? We all need what? names. What? Holy shit. You should too. I don't need one. Why not? Because I am not going to stay here with you. You've got some sort of plan? I do. Yeah? What's that? You sure you want to know? Yeah. All right. Let me show you. I'm going to do this. <laughs> hey! What the hell do you think you're doing? Stay back. Ah. Mike was still muted. There we if go. If you That's get better. any closer. Did not expect Liquid Snake and Lola Rito from this guy. I'll cut her open. Uh. Yeah, that's right. Clover, are you all right? Yeah, I'm uh. fine. What the hell are you trying to do? I told you. This is my plan. What are you going to do to her, you sick son of a bitch? Don't worry. I'm not going to do anything to her. If she just does what I tell her to, I'll let her go. <laughs> Slowly. That's right. Just follow me. Here. Verify. <laughs> the left. Look on your left. Do you see the device on the wall? Place your hand on the scanner panel. The round part. What if I don't? Are you an idiot? What do you think? I could slit your throat right now. I'll kill you if I have to. All I need is your bracelet. <laughs> Just do it. Do Break it now. Uh, okay, I'll do it. Like this. So that's how it works. He called that round part of the device the scanner panel. If we put our left hand on it, our bracelet number gets entered into the device. Then... Should you total the numbers on your numbered bracelets, and find that the digital root of that number is equal to the number of that door, the door will open. Door 5. But why does this guy know so much about how this thing works? It's like he knows exactly what to do. Good. Good. You're done. Next. You, right? You're the one with the number one bracelet, right? Yes. I am. So? Then you're next. Just verify your number like this little brat did. <laughs> what are you doing? Do it! Don't you care what happens to her? Not okay, really. <laughs> okay, just calm down. I'm coming over. Now, verify. All right, this is what you wanted, right? Now the device has both Clover and Ace's numbers, four and one. Four plus one is five. It's the same as the number written on the door, but it won't open yet. Yeah. Only three to five. <laughs> You're gonna learn how to play this game. We're gonna kill door. this little girl. One more person. If what Zero said is true, he needs one more person. Who? Who does he need? Get back! No! Farther! More than that! Go all the way back! Okay. Don't tell me. Clover's four, and Ace is one. Hmm. Gotta think about this math now. Nine. Four plus one plus nine is fourteen, and the digital root of fourteen, one plus four, is five. Hooray! <laughs> Thank God you were all so cooperative. Now I can get out of this nightmare. Good. I don't need 
need you anymore. <gasps> Wait! Here! She's all yours. <gasps> okay. Have a good one, guys. I'm going off ahead now. Well then, goodbye. Somebody forgot to read the rest of the note. Clover, are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. Damn it! That bastard! Open, damn it! Shit! It won't budge. Do you hear something? Like, what? Like, some sort of beeping. You're right. I can hear it too. What is it? Yeah, 999. Why is it stopping? God damn it! You. you lied! Lied? This wasn't supposed to happen! This is wrong! This is wrong! What is happening in there? Open the door, please! I'm begging you! Help me! Please get me out of here! Ah, God damn it! <coughs> Why? Why won't it work? Because it's occupied. It's like a bathroom. Engaged? Is it because it's occupied? Uh, also, thump, thump, oh thump, God, thump, oh thump, thump the game. There's no time left! Listen, I was lied to! He lied to me! He put me in here! It was him! He killed me! It was him! This voice acting's pretty good, though. I'm actually kind of down for this. <laughs> and boom goes the dynamite! <gasps> A beep? Did that thing just make that sound? Um... The display changed from engaged to vacant. Let's see if we can open it. Okay. Well, it registered my bracelet number, but it won't open with one person. We need at least two more people. Ace, Lotus, you think you could give me a hand here? Hmm. Five plus one plus eight equals fourteen. Junpei teaches math yet the again. Root of fourteen. One plus. This should do it. Now we just need to pull the lever on the side. You guys ready? I'm gonna open it. And now the greatest prize for math. Oh my God. Good God. Yeah. Whoa, that's pretty bad. I can't believe I actually. Broke out how to do the digital roofs. I forgot how much you do it in this game. So it's hard to forget. Also, I forgot about this part. Like, not the fact that there's going to be blood, just the shock visual of it. June, uh, are you okay? I mean, a man just fucking exploded, so. What the hell? Where'd this fever come from? She got that blood fever. Uh... All right, okay, uh, let's just rest for a minute, okay? Uh, you think you can walk? Here we go. How are you feeling? Are you all right? Why? Why did this happen? Why did this happen? Do any of you know what the fuck is going on here? Who's Zero? What's this nonary game? Come on! Anybody? Anything? What the hell is going on? What are we doing here? <laughs> it's ten o'clock. Hopefully we sit an hour on this shit. That means it's been an hour since Zero's little announcement. Fuck! I've had enough of this crap! How long are we gonna pussyfoot around like this? We've only got eight hours until this time limit zero is going on about is up. Let's get going already. Go, Thank go. Thank you. Follow Tatrolia. No, I refuse. I'm not gonna end up like him. Him? You mean the ninth man? Of course. Who else? 
And thank you, Harvey, for the follow. Blood. Oh, blood and pieces of flesh. Yes, this is what happens when people explode. That's no way for a person to die. <clears throat> I think he just screwed up. He probably set off some sort of trap and that killed him. I'm not going to screw up like that. I'm getting out of here alive. <laughs> <laughs> What's so goddamn funny? Oh, my apologies. You were just uh, <laughs> so very confident. I couldn't help myself. What the fuck? <laughs> I agree with you on that one, Santa. <laughs> I think you've mistaken the situation. Huh? Snake is the best. He, he was always one of my favorite characters when I played this. The ninth man's death. It had nothing to do with the trap. Or at least not the sort of trap you imagine it did. Then? He broke one of Zero's rules. That was why he died. Quite simple if you think about it. Huh? You still don't... Ugh. All right. How about you take a moment and think back to what Zero said? Why don't you think about it, idiot? Specifically, what did he say about the number of people? He said only three to five people can pass through one numbered door. Right? And after that? You've forgotten the relevant part. What did Zero say? <sighs> Everyone verified how to go through. All those who enter I must could pick leave, the wrong options, and all who but enter must contribute. I don't feel like wasting that time. I think it was something like that. Whatever it was, it it means that groups of less than three or more than five can't go through. That is correct. A gold star for you, Junpei. Fuck yeah, gold star. The ninth man, however, broke that rule. He tried to pass through a numbered door by himself. That was why he was executed. And Zero's watching us from somewhere. <laughs> making sure we don't break any rules. Oh, I'm not so sure of that. Why not? Because this execution system is entirely automatic. You didn't notice? There's no need for him to monitor us. What do you mean? Very well. I see it must be me who tells you. I am the smart one here. I've waited long enough, I suppose. I had hoped Zero might spare me the trouble, but that seems increasingly unlikely. Do you know something? Well, I know a great many things, but yes. <laughs> what is it you know? So very fucking humble. Here. A card? What does it say? See for yourself. <laughs> it says Come I know on, everything. What's the point of giving me this? Give me that. If you won't uh, read it, I will. What the hell is this? <laughs> I see. This is Braille. Ah. Uh... Sorry, guys. I I can't read this. Here, <laughs> have it back. See ya, Zilla. Okay, that was fun. What's so important about that card? I found it in my pocket. I can only wow. assume it is a message from Zero. From Zero? A message? Wh what does it say? Calm down now. No need to panic. Is that what it says? You don't need to force me. I'll read it. <clears throat> Bracelet number two. Since you are not blessed with sight, I shall bless you and only you with information. I shall tell you of the function of the red, of the dead, and of the bracelet. Oh god, do we have to have this voice again? I'm gonna skip through some of this because I can't stand this fucking modulation voice. Hmm, whatever could a detonator detonate? <laughs> this is inappropriate, Zero. And then promptly everyone tries. As I mentioned before, 
one point on your left hand contains a bit mirror. In a rate as a remote field, or timer, the god in your body. There is only one condition to call it it made. That condition is that you enter a numbered door. Once you have done so, the time will end. Oh god, this really is... You will have 81 seconds. Oh, I know exactly who you're talking about Tertullia, and I cannot wait to get back to it. If, after my time, the detonator has not been deactivated, it will send a signal to the bomb. Bomb your body, starting to explode, blah blah blah. They're one of my favorite. Yeah, that's one of my favorite characters in that game, and I'm extremely excited to get back to it. And I, the voice doesn't drive me insane like this. Blah blah blah. Alright, I'm just gonna skip through this. Yes, yes. I will quickly go over this once it's done because I just. This is okay. all the information which I can impart to you. Scan the bracelet. You scan the bracelet again. If you don't scan the bracelet again after going through the door, you're fucking dead. Ta da! And it didn't take that long, and my voice doesn't sound like this. How you choose to use it is for you to decide. If used. No. Oh. I wish you the best of luck. Hit me click through his dialogue. Yep. So it's basically same. that. Everyone has a scanner, everyone go boom. Only those who verify their numbers at the red can pass through. Teams can't add or subtract people after they're scanned in. The reds, deads, and bracelets enforce the rules. Oh, oh, shit! A fucking bomb! <laughs> and what do we all try to do immediately? <laughs> There's a bomb inside me. Oh, what made Zero think creating this horror show of a game was a good idea? What indeed? Right. I'm gonna ask one more time. Do any of you know anything about Zero? Actually, reaction shots. I, I saw him. I saw Zero when I got grabbed. I didn't see his face, though. Son of a bitch was wearing some kind of gas mask. What the hell? Come on, guys, give me something. You know, like, surprise or something? I no, we all saw him. I did as well. Me too. I didn't see inside the mask, though. That mask, it was really scary. Huh? <laughs> oh, so all of our abductions were the same. We were taken from home at midnight. The person claiming to be Zero had a mask on. See you, Tertullia. Thanks for jumping in. There was white smoke, and then each of us passed out. We woke up to find ourselves on D-Deck, in a room with a three- How about you, Seven? Did the same happen to you? Oh, me? Yeah, well, mine was just like the rest of yours. Okay, uh, that's good enough for now. So, I have a question. Snake and Clover, you were both kidnapped from the same room, and you woke up together. So, what's the deal with the two of you anyway? We're siblings. Siblings? Uh, yes. Snake is my older brother, obviously. Really? He's your that older brother? His little sister. That really so hard to understand? She is correct, of course. Are you, uh, surprised? Well, yeah, but... Why? There are other people here with connections to one another. Those two, for instance. Oh, you mean between Jumpy and me? Oh, yes. You did say you were childhood friends, didn't you? Wait, you went to school together? Yeah. Well, yeah. Hey, you think maybe we could figure out who Zero is this way? Yeah, you're right. You connect the dots between the victims and that leads you to the perp. Textbook stuff. Junpei, Jun, does any of this ring a bell? Huh, ring a bell. Ring a bell? a bell? Well, perhaps you went to school with the son of a multi-millionaire. <laughs> a millionaire? Son? Well, someone bought this boat and set up all of this. Whoever Zero is, they must be incredibly rich. Well, we can't be sure of that. To me, this seems as though it's the work of an organization, not an individual. Most likely, Zero is simply the representative of a larger group. What sort of organization? It I don't know. A number of things. <laughs> Someone lets army, murder perhaps, kids? Or a research, perhaps, this is all some sort of psychological experiment. 
If it is, then it's a pretty fucked up experiment. I'll agree with Santa on that I one. I mean, come on! A guy's dead! Really? Oh, yeah. I don't know who the hell this Zero asshole is, but I know for sure he's gotta be pretty fucked up in the head to do all this. If this was all one guy, then he's got some serious issues. Oh, cool. We we'll spent another half hour talking about this. I thought we were this. finished with that topic. But then what should we do? We should talk it through. Oh my god, enough! All we're doing is talking! I'm bored! Talking won't solve anything! It can't help us find our way out of here! You really sure you want to just sit around? We've only got seven and a half hours left. We already wasted an hour and a half of our nine hours. You're right. Very well then. There's only one way for us to proceed. Sure not gonna be fun running around knowing we gotta jump when Zero says jump. Well, it's stupid to just sit around here doing nothing. Thanks to Snake's card, at least we have some idea of how this all works. Correct. And so long as we all follow the rules, we should, uh, we will most likely be all right. <laughs> Very confident. But... But what? Who's going to go in which door? Oh yeah, uh, that's right. We can't have any more than five people in one door. All eight of us can't go in the same door. Then it would seem we will have to split up. Wait. I'm telling you now, there is no way in hell that I'm going into door five. Come on now, don't be selfish. Call me whatever the hell you want. I'm not going in there. I kind of get that opinion. If I'm going to have to walk through all that blood, then I'd rather stay here. It's th This game gets kind of crazy. And we were doing so well. Sorry, but I ain't going in there either. Someone else can go into door five. Oh, Santa, not you too. He's got, I'll get blood over my wet clothing. Hey, man, I just bought these shoes. Yeah. If you think I'm getting some creepy dude's blood all over him, you got another thing coming. I promise I'm not doing this because I actually remember what they say. I'm just doing it because I'm hell, making man? fun of him. Weren't you the one who kept saying we should get going? Yeah. So? Doesn't mean I have to get going through door five. Doesn't mean I wanted to go into door five. <laughs> Keep doing it. Oh, God. Fine. I'll go into door five. I can't go in there alone, though. Anyone else willing to come with me? I'll go. What? Don't worry. You'll be fine. We may part now, but I'm certain we'll meet again later. How do you know that? Because I do. That's not an answer! If you're Too bad. Going, I'm going too. I'm going into door five. What am I going to do with you? There's nothing you have to do. If I join you, the problem is solved, correct? Seven is seven, and Snake is two. And if you add Clover's four in my one, the digital root will be five. Seven plus two plus four plus one is 14. <laughs> Thank you, Santa. <laughs> the digital root of 14. One plus... Oh, it works perfectly. The four of us can go into door five. Wait, what about the other four? What's their digital root going to be? Lotus, Santa, June, and me. Our bracelet numbers are eight... Three, six, and five. Nine, fourteen. No, nine, thirteen. Yep, eight, that three, works. Six, five. What would our eight plus three plus six plus five is twenty-two. So the digital root of twenty-two, two plus two equals four. It's four. Add up our four bracelet numbers, and the digital root is four. Then we can go into door four. Yeah. Huh. That worked out well. So the team assignments will be like this. Seven, Snake, Clover, and Ace. They would go through door five. Lotus, Santa, June, and me will go through door four. Ta-da! Are these really the teams I want? Beyond door five is the remains of the ninth man. I never want to see that thing again, but something's telling me that it'd be a good idea to examine the corpse, even just a little closer. Of course, if I went through door 5, I wouldn't be going with Lotus and Santa. I could bring June with me through door 5, but that means she'd have to see the body in there. I don't want to put her through that. Should I stay silent and go through door 4? Or should I stop them and insist on door 5? Alright then. It seems we've reached a conclusion, shall we? I'm going through door 5. We're over there too, right? The door's not going anywhere. Slow down. I... which door? 
So we're gonna stick with door four. I'll go through door four with Lotus, Santa, and June. There's nothing to worry about. I just need to stay by her side. This should be fine. It's no problem this way. I should see the other four off. Looks like Ace and the others are going. Uh. Now then, goodbye. Be careful. Ta-da! So horrible! You're the one who wanted to go. <laughs> what are you doing? We need to hurry. Snake, you're sh It's fine. Or <laughs> are you planning on dying with everyone else? I assume you haven't forgotten the door only remains open for nine seconds, have you? Sorry, Snake! Let's go! Hey! How is it over there? Did you find anything? Please say something, will you? Uh, something's beeping. It's just like before. Probably the sound of the detonator on the bracelet. Do you think they're okay? Uh. Uh. Hey, there it is! That's gotta be that dead thing! Come on, get over here! We gotta watch it! The beeping stopped. Phew. Looks like it stopped. Hey, hey did guys. it! Are you doing all right over there? Yes, we're fine. Oh, hey, I'm gonna tell you about this whole dead thing, okay? We're just gonna forget about this dead body that's all over the walls in here. The dead is just like the red. You know how the red was red? Well, the dead is blue. Wow. Other than that, it's just like the red. Authenticating is the same thing. <laughs> awesome. Thanks. Well, we should probably move on now. You be careful out. Roger that. Oh, get me back to a puzzle. I'm tired of reading text. Now it's our turn. I'll go first. Okay. We ready? Yeah. Sure. Let's go. All right. Let's go. Run! Oh, damn. It's counting down. Counting down with what? There's no numbers. It's a purple skull. We can't go back! We need to hurry and find the device. Hey! Where the hell is the dead? How would I know? Don't give me that crap! Start looking! I already am! Don't tell me the dead is in one of those rooms. Oh no! How many rooms do you think there are? Ah, uh, fuck! We don't have time to count. We just need to open them all. At the end of the hallway. Run! Hey, how many more seconds do we have? How would I know? Our time limit is 81 seconds! I know that, goddammit! I'm asking you how many seconds we have left! Should have been counting, idiot. Hurry! It's the dead! Get over here! Come on, every. Hooray! <gasps> nobody exploded. <sighs> Looks like it stopped. <laughs> There's another Not yet. door at the end of the hallway. Let's try this one first. And of course it won't open. A keyhole. What's this mark? It mail? No, not exactly. That's probably the symbol of Mars. Well, technically, they are the same symbol, but... I saw a number of similar symbols near the main stairway. Yes, we talked the about them The symbols earlier. of the solar system. Oh, th that's right. The sun, Saturn, and Earth. At least that's what I'm assuming. So this isn't the man symbol. It's a symbol for Mars? I think so, yes. I see. Wait, where's Santa? Yeah, so... I look the place over. Here's the deal. None of the other doors open. Cool. Then that must mean... We only have two more doors. 
Oh, right. Maybe it's the room number. The door on the left has a B92, and the one on the right says B93. All right. I forgot about these Let's doors. Let's open them. I'll open B9. Okay. I'll get B. One, two, three. <laughs> hey. Bunch it spazzes. opened. Yeah, <laughs> it did. I uh, I didn't expect that. It was so easy. Maybe this is all part of Zero's plan. Can't say I enjoy being treated like someone's puppet. Well, now we have these two rooms. I'm sure there's something in there that will help us get out of here. Let's find yep. it. Santa and I will search this room. You two take the other one. All right. Okay. All right, it's puzzle time. Now I can actually do things again. So I click and read. Big. I'd say inconsequential decisions, but at least one of the decisions that I made did have a consequence. And we'll cut it here to be starting the second of many, many puzzles and many, many strange conversations. Tune in next time for actual gameplay.